Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to the Common Sense Crypto Channel. As with you always, this is Rich doing another video on Luna 2.0. But before I get started, please click the like and subscribe button as it helps this channel grow very quickly. And if you have already done so, I want to thank each and every one of you and I appreciate each and every one of you. You are the reason I'm here. So we're looking at Luna 2.0. It's down 2.90%. I'm not too concerned about it because I think we're going to see some upside movement. So, Luna 2.0 is just a token without a use case. Just a copy of Luna Classic. I don't think that's true. Because we see now staking. We see it, uh, NFT stuff going on around Luna 2.0. So, they're starting to build upon this a little bit. I don't think it's happening as fast as people thought it was going to. I'm surprised the staking already actually took place. Like, this is happening. It's live now. So, there's a lot of optimism for Luna 2.0, as there should be, because this is supposed to help people recover. And people lose sight of that. You know, it, when it comes to money, people lose sight of the big picture. And Luna 2.0 was supposed to make some people whole i just think they fell short on how much they gave you based on how much luna classic you held so we also see this do exchanges support terra luna 2.0 lenden x supports it okay and so did a whole bunch of other exchanges in the last couple days i mean it's pretty much listed everywhere i believe uphold now has luna 2.2.0 available also and then we see this fingers crossed luna 2.0 will increase in value and give some financial recompense to the ones who got burnt last time that's exactly what i was just saying so it's supposed to make some people whole and people over in like like luna classic they're like okay i'm not going to support luna 2.0 at all and people in rap luna i'm not going to support luna 2.0 at all but the thing is, Luna 2.0 brings new investors in. People that never even heard of Luna before now heard of Luna. I mean, you could pretty much ask anybody. It don't matter who you talk to, if they're in crypto or not. You mention Luna, they know exactly what happened. And I'm hoping all three coins make it through all of this. And I hope every one of the moons, and I'm, I hope people get rich. It's just how I feel. So then we see this. Luna 2.0 flops after first week as analysts warn market will never be the same again. We see this narrative with Luna 2.0 and this could be why. Because we're in extreme fear. It keeps, it this drops. I think originally it was at like 16, it came down. Now we're at 13. And I think people feel that way because this could be one of the reasons why. Apparently... Luna 2.0 is endeavoring to make another stable coin. They're going to wreck the market again. People feel that way. They don't, I think they should stay away from the stable coin for a while. I think they should let Luna 2.0 run its course and see what happens. See how many people get behind it. As things start to move, more and more people find more optimism in it. So in other words, Luna 2.0 starts pumping back up. Maybe it gets up to $12 or so. So now people are like, okay, well, it's headed up. I should get in on this before it's too late. So it brings optimism. And then we could get out of that extreme fear. Then we see this. So Luna 2.0 price forecast. How high can it go? And then I found this. While Luna 2.0 price struggles for bull run, the price is set to drop by 45% in the coming days. Now that's going to depend on one thing. And this is that one thing right here. I think that Luna 2.0 will hit higher trading volume in a month or two. And it will pull Luna Classic with it. Up so both will get pumped in their prices. I believe that Luna and Luna Classic all time high can hit when... The Bitcoin starts getting up. That I've been saying that in a lot of videos. Because when Bitcoin pumped just a little bit, I think it was like a couple days ago, it took Luna 2.0 and Luna Classic with it. So think about it like this. Okay, how high can the price go? Well, if 
Bitcoin goes back up to 50k, where people are projecting it to go even higher. Uh, what do you think is going to happen with Luna 2.0? Of course it's going to pump. Luna Classic will pump. The whole market will pump. But I want to see Luna 2.0 pump on its own, with its own use cases coming into, the, into it, and NFT kind of stuff, and staking and rewards. I want to see some optimism around it before that happens, because that'll tell us exactly how high the price can go. And with that said, I'm going to wrap up this short video on Luna 2.0. I just want to let you know I'm optimistic about it. I want it to pump. Hopefully we see some price action very soon. I want to thank you all for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Have a great night.